Hey there YouTube, it's Math Buller with a midweek autograph video. So Troy Polamalu, congratulations. You are going to the Hall of Fame. So I wanted to show my autograph Troy Polamalu items, just like how I did with my Bill Cower items. Maybe I should do the same thing for Donnie Shell, but I don't have as much of him, but uh I grew up watching Troy Polamalu play, so I definitely want to make sure I got this video out there. So yes, member of the Super Bowl 40 and 43 team. First item, first of three items, we got this full-size football here, and it was signed <coughs> when Troy Polamalu made his appearance through Total Sports Enterprises. He's done that a couple of times. So it's got the tamper-proof sticker, which is more important than the uh, little paper COA here. But yeah, that football looks awesome. Full panel. Now, Troy Polamalu's autograph is pretty simple. You got the three crosses, and that's, and then loops through them. I mean, a very religious individual. So, yeah, I got a football. I've also got this yellow, gold colored mini helmet. Now, the only issue with this is that this was signed through Steel Town Memorabilia. Steel Town Memorabilia's owner, Josh Corb, got into some serious trouble. Um, they would bring in athletes. There's video proof of him signing stuff for them. But uh, after the athletes would sign some stuff, they would then fake some items as well. So really tough to figure this type of signature out. But in any case, there's that item. Um, since he is now a Hall of Famer and not many of my items are suspect, I did not submit this item to JSA. I did my Ben Roethlisberger with the Big Ben inscription from Steel Town Memorabilia. I submitted that one and it came back authenticated, but... Uh, this one needs to get added to that list. So, yep, I do have the gold mini helmet. No concerns about the uh, football, which looks beautiful. And there's also no concerns about the 16 by 20 framed photo here, that, because this was also Total Sports Authenticated. So no concerns from me. And I'm glad I bought that football and this 16 by 20 when I did, because had I did not, I'd be paying a lot more money for it. So when I was looking for the 16 by 20 frame photos of Troy Polamalu, I picked this one. Because to me, that's the Troy Polamalu I remember on the field. Super nice guy off the field, um, but he would just go insane crazy. He was awesome. Just a free roaming, do whatever he felt like he needed to do, safety. And uh, yeah. So there he is, just looks like he's ready to uh, tear Gronkowski apart there. So yeah, that's my uh, 16 by 20 autograph Troy Polamalu photo. So uh, let me know what you think in the comments down below, what items you liked, or if you remember any pretty cool stories or situations with Troy Polamalu. Um, if you go on YouTube or whatever, it's Pat McAfee has a pretty good... Uh, situation which Troy Palma like ruined his life <laughs> in a rather funny story not tragic or anything but uh yeah there's lots of cool Troy th things out there so anyway I hope you enjoyed my video I post something once every weekend and occasionally during the week as well so feel free to let me know in the comments below what was your favorite item and uh give my video a like comment and subscribe to my channel take care everybody